I'm River Bay, and welcome to my gun kingdom. Okay, so when mounting a red dot scope, we want to make sure we get it in the right position on the rifle to improve our performance in shooting. Um, and the best place to put a red dot scope would be all the way forward here. Um, and that's going to open up more field of view on the right side and on the left side, okay? So that's for better target acquisition. So if we're shooting in a competition, we would be able to move from target to target a lot quicker and get on site a lot faster. And also we wanna practice shooting with both eyes open. Okay, so another thing you might wanna to consider too is getting a riser. This is a half inch riser that I have on here. And this also helps me get to on target a lot faster than I would without a riser, all right? So you don't have to get your head down as far on, on the comb of the gun, all right? So those two things right there are going to help you with your, your shots getting off faster and improving your target acquisition. All right, so, uh, so where do we mount the red dot scope? Well, first of all, we can start out by lining it up with parts on the rifle, okay? Or we can just mount it as far forward as possible. Because remember, we don't have to worry about eye relief with the red dot scope, all right? So, because there's no magnification with these scopes, all right? So we can have it as far forward as possible. All right, but if you wanna use a part on your rifle, there's two parts actually that you can use. And one is the ejection port. So if you wanted to start out and see where it works best for you, um, I would line it up with this ejection port right here and put the red dot scope middle there, all right? So, and then if, you, if that's too far back, another place that you can mount it is right here. And in the back here is a uh, bulge here in, in the upper receiver. And this is where the cam pin rotates. All right, so we could line it up right in the middle of that too to get a reference point. All right, so there we got the scope mounted right in the middle. And if those work out fine for you, or if you want something a little bit faster acquisition, then I would move it all the way forward. And, and try that and see how it works. But you're just gonna have to try out different positions. So I hope this helped you out. And um, if it did, please subscribe to my channel and hit that like button. Share it with your friends and ring the notification bell. I appreciate you watching this video. Thank you.